Let's get right back in. All right. Um, actually, I meant to double check. I'm not crazy. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yep, I'm not crazy. It is before the tree. So let's go to the tree and then over here. Yes! I knew it! I knew there was something hidden here. I just wasn't searching right. I feel like a fool. Daemon Slayer. That's what we wanted. Kind of like the Dragon Slayer. Um, which is, uh, insta-kills dragons. The Daemon Slayer will insta-kill daemons. And we are going to want that for a dungeon in the next chapter. Because I believe, I believe, yeah, I believe the, there's a hard-coded, uh, dungeon. It's either the next chapter or the chapter after that. It's one of the few hard-coded things. Okay. Now we can head on to the boss. I'm going to go ahead and save. Because I want to show them off. And then we will swap to the insta-kill. Ugh. The, uh... What is a dragon zombie doing here? It's hard to believe that it suffered a mortal wound in combat. Welcome to Dragon Zombies. Come to me, dark warriors. Battle awaits us. Father, mother, they are one of the toughest early game enemies. Unless you have a weapon they're vulnerable to. I did... What did she have equipped? Hold on. I wanted to show off a round of combat against it without insta-killing it. Um... Lenith? Lenith, what the fuck do you have equipped? It's fucking weak to lightning. And this weapon insta-kills anything weak to lightning. Well, that's what I meant about weapons that will insta-kill an enemy. Um... <laughs> I was gonna use the Dragon Slayer against it, but, uh, okay. Um... The thing is, is if you're being super sweaty min-maxing, uh, what you can do is have your characters a high enough uh, level that you won't get one shot by its attacks and you can keep people topped off with healing or potions and then you can just constantly juggle the enemy and stack up just tons and tons of bonus XP crystals. Because, like, each crystal is, I want to say, 5% more experience. And you saw one dragon zombie gave 4,200 experience. So if you get, like, 50 XP crystals for, like, you know, 250% uh, experience, and then if you fight, like, multiple dragon zombies, like, it adds up really fast. Um, well, damn. All right. Now, there is a minor... I would reset, but only because I have a save right there. 
Bark of the Dryad. Of all these treasures we need to hold on to, this is, this is like reset worthy if we accidentally got rid of this. Most of the things are just like, instead of like, eh, it's a pretty good weapon, eh, it's a neat little item, whatnot. But Bark of the Dryad is going to be very useful to us later. Um, I'm the Valkyrie. I'm the one that's doing the work here. We're going to fucking keep everything. All right, our evaluation's at 78. And yes, we got everything out of that area. Good shit. I'm gonna wanna save right fast quick. And now we've got the second dungeon of this chapter, Salerno Academy. Uh, I hope you like plants. Because, uh, this place... Pretty crazy. The Sorcerer of Flensburg once conducted black magic experiments on plants here. Wizard is long gone and the facilities are in disrepair, but the area is threatened by the experimental plants that were created. It seems evil forces are gathering there. It's funny because, like, druids are a type of enemy. They're not good guys. Oh, this guy. Oh, I just want to show something off. Ah, shit! So you've seen me sliding. But you can actually get, like, a huge speed boost if you slide off the top of enemies, like that. <laughs> Why do you look like the guy that says I can't move it? No matter who the opponent, are you King Julius from Madagascar? I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like. To Wait, hold on. Is it not working? Hold on, hold on. Why is this not working? Why is this not working? Hold on. Maybe I need to... Um... Why are my commands not working? One moment. Damn it, streamer bot. You're interrupting a bit. Um... Um... Ex excuse me? No, wait, what? Hold up. Alright! How about now? I do not know what StreamerBot is fucking doing. I have a button held down. Is that what it was? Yeah, that's what it was. All right, I was so fucking scared. It looked like StreamerBot deleted a bunch of my uh, commands. Because they were all blank, but no. Whew. Whew. All right, where was I? All right, I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it, move it. I like to move it. Oh, that, uh, the, the spin isn't fast enough. You get the idea. <laughs> I remember like Madagascar one. Uh, I put, I, I definitely had some of those songs on. Like, I feel like that era of like animated movies had a lot of very mimetic songs that stuck in the head. Ha! 
Lofers. I like Lofers, just... Ha! I feel like Lofers not using the weapon I want him to be using. Yeah, he's on a short spear. Damn it! Because Lawford does have a pretty good uh, uh, three-hit combo. It also looks a lot of working on my string toy. Yeah! Yeah, this was also made by uh, Shadow Fox. Um, damn it, I, I meant to fix... Uh, I, I, had a sh I had a hotkey button to auto, like, shout out my model creator, like, whichever model is loaded. If you do exclamation point model, or I think exclamation point avatar, it should give a link to, like, their stuff. Um, but she has, she does a lot of really good, a lot of really good stuff. And uh, she made this as well as my original model. I swear to fucking dog. I swear to fucking dog. Streamer bot. Streamer bot. Please. Streamer bot. I beg of you. Please. 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 Please don't do this to me. No. No. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I'm going to cry. Uh... Wait, that's the that's not the right command. I'm trying to see if it's disabled. Let me check my triggers. So, not that, not that, not that. Channel reward, no. Core. Not that. I want credit. Not hotkeys. Not timed actions. Right, so it's down here. So this is active. I have it set to master text file. Has the file path. I specifically made this command. All right. Note to future me. Maybe just redo everything. I would shit myself. <laughs> like the uh this this little movement thing uh that was a good 12 ish hours of like coding and testing uh to get that together and that's only half of it i'm working on also making it so i can do that movement with a, uh, with my PNG tuber. But that one is a few layers more difficult. Ha! Ha! Not so easy. Not so easy. Bridget Damsel! Oh, that monkey is fucked up. Now, the downside is, if you want to juggle enemies, um, your unit has to already be attacking so them. Easy. So the fact that Frigid Damsel killed them and then I tried to use my other characters to juggle them um, didn't work. But if you mash all the buttons so they're, like, attacking as they die, you can get them to continue attacking. Their souls have been released. We have no reason to remain here. Okay, let's give Lawfer that spear I bought that gives him all three attacks. 
even though it technically has a lower attack value uh, by about 50, the fact that it gives him all three of his attacks makes it extremely effective. And overall, I think do more damage. Like, come on, come on. More hits, more damage. That's just how it works. Um, actually, you know what? Let's just, let's explore down and left. We did down and right in the swamp. I don't remember where we get, like there, there's gonna be an overwall puzzle and it's gonna take me a minute to get the solution because it's been a minute and it has a few possible solutions. And then let's see what uh, his uh, limit break is. Finishing strike. Just the stream. Just fucking casually makes a tornado. <laughs> Not so easy. Not so easy. I'll do an investigation. Yeah. Ha! Ha! Yeah, see now now we're now we're juggling enemies. Now we're getting charge orbs. Bridget Damsel. Bye. Too slow. Be damned. Oof. Literally walked into that one, June. Ah, he missed. Uh, we'll just, uh, combo out this one. Hell yeah. Ooh! Ha! All right, so we got him stunned, and now we're gonna fuck his day up. Ah, I didn't time that right. Refresh the stream and your name color changed. Uh, do you have it set? Let us go, my friends. I don't, I know there's a place in chat settings to set your color. I still see you as pink. At least in the little chat window I have. Like, if you don't have a set color, it will, um, randomly select one for you. To my side, my noble Einherjar. And, like, you're showing like, up as pink in my, uh, overlay. And the overlay is taking straight from the chat API. So I don't know. I don't know, man! I don't know. I don't know if it's just that it looks pink to me. Looks green for you. Interesting. I wonder if it's like different colors per person perceiving it. So the fact that it's taking from my view of chat on the Twitch API, that because I am seeing it as pink, it is being rendered as pink. Um, I want to say it's one of the settings thing at the bottom of chat. If you're on browser, if you're on mobile, I'm sorry. Uh, I have no idea what the fuck. I barely use Twitch mobile because it is fucking atrocious. Not even close. Um, but there should be a setting to like hard code whatever uh, color you want. Cause I've set mine to orange, so I'm orange everywhere. Interrupted, baby. Damsel. 
Man, we're, uh, we're kind of getting pretty power leveled a lot earlier than I was expecting. I'm usually struggling until about chapter, uh, four or five. Ooh, and now, now we've got, uh, now we're kind of glowing. We're kind of stinky. Kind of stinky. Is, uh, red-orange. I feel like I've seen that. Seen it as red at some point. Huh. Yeah, there's like two shades of orange. Corpse of a human female. You found perfume. Don't use. Alright, so we can't get through this yellow flowers. She gives us blue. So let's get red. We're going to need to juggle these uh, perfumes in such a way to get past some areas. Just open chat on a separate tab. This isn't color settings. Yeah, it should be like a little gear. I think. Maybe. Or maybe it's next to the emoji. I, I don't know. I'm probably not very good help going off memory. <laughs> I just set things so long ago and I haven't touched them since. Most I do is go into BTTV to upload new emotes. Like the, uh, the little eyes one that uh, Glottal made for me. That thing is extra wide and extra fucking awesome. Slanting Rain. I think that's an archer ability. Honestly, I don't really like a lot of the archers. Archer characters. Uh, I don't... I think my normal my normal team composition is like two casters and then two melee warriors. Um, either uh, the light blade warriors or polearm warriors. Because there's another, uh, uh, another light blade, like June, I, I don't know, I don't know if that's the specific what actual weapon class name. I just call it light blade warriors, uh, because they can use the katanas. But, um, there's June another one we get later that I really area. like. June's okay. We have nothing but to fight. Um, he's kind of flashy and he's kind of a kind of a guy. I don't know. I think he's got a cool outfit and he's kind of sweet, but I think there's a there's a much much more fun one later that I like using. And then there is a polearm person that is usually my mainstay and I may keep them and not send them up to Valhalla at all. But I think around when we get them, like they really don't fit any of the requirements for sending up anyway. <laughs> fucking Lawfer and June just fucking this monkey up. Blade Art. Senko Jin. Now your future is emptiness. Hmm. Get over here! Stab, stab, stab. Ah, uh, we don't need to do that. It might not go so well next time. Hmm. Longbow and a short spear. Yay, all these weapons that I don't really need. Well, at worst case, I can turn them into uh, currency. To my side, my noble Einherjar. Okay, everyone, be brave. Ha! 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 in chat settings. It's like, I remember the way it looks, is like there's like a grid of colors 
in little circles, and then you can pick one. I also kind of feel like I'm gaslighting myself. It's like, I know I've seen it. Where is it? Where is it? Where's the chat color settings? Tell me, Joker. I need to be baby blue. Their souls have been released. We have no reason to remain here. Release their souls. There's a capsule with acid inside it. You found a strong acid. All right, so we got acid. I don't know what this is for, but I'm sure it'll be useful. Ah, the blue flowers. All right, we need to go get the perfume from the lady to get through there. To my side, my noble Einherjar. No matter who the opponent, I shall not yield. And we just knock stuff out of him like a pinata. Didn't hit it fast enough. Come on, Laffer. Gotta be faster than that, buddy. Let's hit him with a naval on Velesti. Edit. Oh, yeah. I couldn't. I can't see chat identity from the the window I have open. Is everyone all right? I kind of like how things look with uh with with chatterino. So that's usually what I kind of use as checking things out. All right. So we got that's the red one. Yeah! Chat identity sounds about right. Fortunately, Lawfer is not very good at hitting enemies knocked up in the air, so he's not good at getting us more XP crystals because you need multi hits mid air for that. But the charge orbs are multi hits on the ground, and that is perfectly fine for getting our caster. Locked and loaded for follow up. I stake everything on this single blow. Let's take him for a spin. Finishing strike. Just the stream. Um, Did I my blow? Maybe I fucked up a bit because I didn't kill him. And ruin this guy's day. No kill like overkill, baby. Their souls have been released. We have no reason to remain here. Short spear, short spear. Man, we are getting a whole lot of short spears. What are these, what are these monkeys doing with them? 
my side, my, my noble, noble Ein Harrier. We have Ansel. nothing but to fight. Ha! 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 All right. Managed to one cycle him. Good stuff. Good stuff. Not even close. Soften up this target. Ah. Damn! Multiple attacks. My one weakness. I stake everything on this single blow. Finishing strike. Come on, Lopper, you can do this. There you go, buddy. I shall cut open my own path. I shall cut open my own path. Jin, uh, chop up this vegetable. Blade art. Senko Jin. Die and be gone. I do like how even if they're dead, you can still do more uh, limit breaks. Just if you really hate something. Um, are we now glowing yellow? I think we are. If we go over here... Yep, the red flowers are back. Hmm... If we can get back up there, what does going down here take us? You may be- you may in fact be dead. But I want you dead uh Could you do that for me? To my side, my noble Ein Harrier. This we is a level beyond death. I call it Super Death 2. Ah! <laughs> <Touch it down. laughs> Lawfer, how did you whiff? Bruh. You missed. Oh, no. That works. Probably need to heal everyone next chance I get a ch next chance I get an opportunity. It shall be engraved upon your Hit him with the, the Nebelung Velesti. Over? Not every uh, plant can claim to have been trimmed by the one of the goddesses of death. Ha! 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 Mugen no Kensen, Blade Art. I'm sure that would mean a lot more to me if I knew any Japanese, but, uh, I don't. <laughs> like, hmm, yes, those were words that were definitely said. Before my blades, all are powerless. Uh, so we went right. Let me go up. Or are we on the other side of the red plant again? It's over here. Is that a different red plant? Hold on. We go up and right. Yeah, it's the acid thing. Okay, so let's explore to the right. I think what I might need to do is I might need to get red. And keep the red plant down. So I think I think what the acid does is it keeps one of the vines from respawning. That's a codal. Hey, Dre Perrin, welcome on by. Uh, common, common mix-up. 
Um, I have no relation to Quetzalcoatl because I can't fly. I am actually more closely related to Yolmengander because I am a worm, but, you know, I'm kind of in the same region. Uh, hence the, uh, the vibrant plumage. Uh, chat sent me through the string dimension, so right now I'm a worm on a string. Uh, but I assure you, my draconic serpent visage is usually much bigger. It's bigger, I swear. <laughs> Lawfer, D my dude, I need you to stop missing like that. You're embarrassing me here. Bang! Get healed. Alright, there you go. At least you killed that one. Good shit, good shit. Ooh, and it fainted. Hells to the yeah. Lawfer, you schmuck. Also, I meant to heal. I need to remember that. Get Damn it, Drecky. Heal. Oblivion heal, heal, me. heal. Heal, 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 heal. Ah. Oh, there are a lot of spoopy enemies here. Blood and ashes. To my side, my noble Ein Okay, everyone. All right, Be before brave. I forget this time, I heal. Lawfer, you had one job, my dude. Oh, Mythgot. Absolutely bananas. But hey, at least it's dead. This is a very jank round of uh, combat. Dude, leave Lawfer alone! I know he's, like, doing really badly when it comes to, like, fucking combat, but, like, you don't need to keep targeting him with Fire Lance. You can just not. What did I just bloody well say? Whatever. They're dead. They're dead! We'll need to heal again next combat, but they're dead. You have served me well, my eye. I can't believe there's four spoopy ghosts all clustered to together side, right here. My, my hook or crook, you shall all die. Uh, heal. Uh, why can you not heal? Oh, they're at full health. All right, that's crazy how that works. Good shit, good shit. There we go! Did no- I don't think any of those charge crystals got to Yume. Gods damn it! That is like the one, like, persistent bug that I hate sometimes, is that things, like the charge crystals, won't actually be used. That's what Lover is there for, to be everyone's slapping boy. Yeah! Unfortunately, he can be a little bit over-eager and uh, over-extend. He forgets he has a halberd. Uh, he's supposed to be standing at a range and swinging. Alright. And one more. That should clear out this area, I think. To my side, my noble Einherjar. I think there's going to be a chest here. Try on what things. The outcome will not change. Ha! Nice, nice. We're going to have like 50 bloody fire spears. Ha! 
Well, crap. It's breathing fire here. All right, so that one's down. And let's see if Lawfer can solo this guy. Yeah, buddy! Our blonde pretty boy is growing up. He gave him a hup, a hi -ya, and then one of them, sir. And then I'll kick him, sir. Fucking uh, little bat from Anastasia. Eye of Heaven. That was not really worth all those fights, to be honest. It's not really a, an amazing item. Okay, so... We need to backtrack for the red perfume. Yeah. I think this is right. Okay, so we get the red. And then we need to Let's go over here to the trigger the red one. Uh, am I lost? So over here is going to be yellow. Fuck! I did it. All right, let's try this again. Yeah. We get the red. We block the red. We can get the blue. Yeah. And take it up to the blue area. Because I think we need to get the yellow after that. And we need this red to stay not spawned for this to work. So you go away. Use the strong acid. There's no more strong acid. All right. Now we get the yellow. Come up here. Trigger the yellow. We swap to the blue. And we backtrack and grab a... N I think we can get a second thing of acid. And then we... Knock the blue down. We keep it down. But I think we're going to need to go back and get the yellow and Too carry it all the way up here. Oh, this looks like it might be tough. Ha! This looks like it might be tough. What are you talking about, Yume? We're fucking them up. All right, maybe Lawfer's not fucking them up, but you and Lennit certainly are. Damn it, Lawfer, you had one job. That was to stab them three times. And now that I say that, I realize that's probably like three jobs. Just trying to remind myself. We'll have a better pole arm later. We'll have a better pole arm later. <laughs> Let us go, my friends. Lover's pretty cool though. He's got a He's got a very strong sense of honor. Icicle Edge. 
And I hate it when my icicles are edging. Yep, we need to get yellow. All right, so let's go back down to the yellow room. Oh, and down, 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 and running to the left. All right, now we smell like yellow. What's over here? A bunch of plants is what's over here. Time for some more gardening. Man traps? But what if I'm not a man? What if Lenneth fights them solo? What are you gonna do then, huh? Plant? Whatever. Might as well as finish uh, everyone's attacks. Pathetic. Pathetic. Ha! Honestly, I've got, I've found so many damn uh, firestorms. I almost should just teach it to uh, Yume, Pathetic. so I can do the, like the AOE fire attack. Because uh, spoiler, plants are weak to fire. I'd rather finish it off than just let it be faint. Don't underestimate me. Pathetic. Nice to see those counter attacks. Ca counter countering. Hey, we knocking. Knocking stuff out of him like a pinata. I didn't expect Lawford to get an XP crystal. That's uh, pretty rare. And Naval and Lestiet. Apparently, plants have souls. Who knew? Well, I did play. Um, Return Death and Taxes, and that one, we literally ran into a plant Grim Reaper who is, is in charge of, like, the plants that died. It's pretty funny. It's like, do you know how many blades of grass there are? Billions! And I have to process all of them as they die. I'm overworked, man! To my side, my noble Ein Herriard. I shall not yield. Uh, let's do a bit of an AOE. Icicle Edge. Yeah, that uh fucked things up, all right. God damn. Who does all the algae? Oh man, that's uh the algae department takes up like three floors. It's really ridiculous. Oh, Lawfer was stunned. That's why he didn't attack. Duh. That <laughs> killed by a familiar. Get cockatooed. All right, and then there were one. Don't underestimate me. Bridget Damsel. Ha! Damn it! I'm trying to time it so June knocks it up slightly before Lawfer does his triple attack. Because I think that's how I got uh, was able to knock out some XP crystals last time. Protists? Do you mean like a protozoa? 
Why do all these treasure chests have explosives? Ah, yeah. yeah. uh, that gate closed. Oh, fuck me. Did I just... Am I fucked? Did I fuck myself over? Okay, that's like a quick way out, I think. All right, so we still have the blue down. We still have the yellow perfume. We'll just bypass this. We need to go up. What's over here? Flame jewel, nice. All right, so that'll probably give me red. Oh, I need to not be smelly or else that plant goes down. So let's get clean. Red. I see. Hmm. So if I become red, is that plant going to wither? It isn't. All right, so it's just the yellow one that was too stinky for it. We need to go over the water fountain to preserve our perfume. I get this creepy flying eyeball. I don't like it. I don't like it looking at me, so we're going to poke it out. To my side, my noble Ein Herriard. Okay, everyone, be brave. Icicle Edge. All right, you may fuck him up. Triple kill. <laughs> Their souls have been released. We have no reason to remain here. Good fucking shit. To my side, my noble Ein Herriard. Try all you want. Good to see that you made at the point where we can just multi-kill all these fuckers. It's also nice how it's uh, knocking Get out some heads. items and shit. Oh, we got a feather from a bird. Hmm. Who'd have thunk it? Alright. I think this should be the last one over this rooftop. And I think we're about to get to the boss. And finish up the Salerno Academy. Fucking shit. Wee! Plop. All right. So let's save. Always save right before fighting the boss. Bada bing, bada boom, baby. What do we have here? Harpy, the flying hag, eh? Die, beast! Abomination! You're an insult to all natural birds! Come to me, dark warriors! Battle awaits us! Weirdly enough that right now is when they do this tutorial about fighting flying enemies. You know, like the fourth possible dungeon you find. Hmm. A difficult foe if fought with a sword, but easily shot and taken down from a distance. Yeah, yeah. Indirect attack and a went down, but I'm on source. Weight reaction for warriors, there's also throw. 
Reflect sorcery. Ah! <laughs> Oops. You may a little fucked up. You've been fighting birds the whole time. Yeah, exactly. All right, Yumi's uh, chilling out, man. Guard break. There we go. I stake everything on this single blow. I think I was too slow hitting the button because I don't think it's going to charge up to 100 again. Damn it! Yeah. I didn't press it fast enough. Faint? Damn it. Now it's time to fuck this bird up! I stake everything on this single you think you're dead? Finish I'll show strike. you dead! Just the stream! You have no more reason to live! Ah, June can't! Damn it! I was trying to do a uh, limit break with every character, but I guess I fucked that up. Such is your fate. Hell yeah, boss down, baby. Let us go, my friends. Bracelet of Zoe, very nice, very nice. Bracelets of Zoe are awesome. They're awesome! Holy Grail! Oh. Yeah, we're just, uh... We're just gonna hold on to the Holy Grail. And, uh... Ooh, the Fame Fen. Oh, that uh, seems like a pretty sword. Pretty cool sword. Pretty cool sword. Uh, we'll just, uh, uh... We'll just hold on to that. And... The Tiara of the Holy Empress! You know, that sounds really cool, and I think we'll hold on to it. <laughs> we want to exit. All right. So, before I do anything else, um, we are definitely sending up Belenis, but we need to choose between Lawfer and June as the second character we're going to send up this chapter. So, if anyone cares... Um... Oh, I need to keep this short to offer. Um, how would I describe them? Um, And then for June, uh... Bam. All right, I'll put it to a poll if anyone uh, wishes to weigh in on which of the two I should send up. And while that runs, let me do a bit of party management.
because we've gotten a few level ups while we were going through. Um, I am wanting to get her traits set up. Because we do want to send her to Asgard, because that was her wish, to join her family in Asgard. We'll just fucking max out her hero value. Making sure she's hella based. And then with everything left over, go to first aid. Magic powers maxed. And we will hold on to anything else so we can finish maxing first aid and uh, whatever extra skills we need. Lawfor apparently has a very punchable face, considering how often he gets attacked. Yeah, yeah, I feel like that's like a passive skill, uh, pretty boy. Just kind of makes all the monsters want to fuck him up, I think. Um, that was our most efficient. Our next most efficient is nothing. They're all one to one. No, this one's not too bad. Damn, Luffer has a lower max hero value than I thought. I thought he was more like 140 or 150. Interesting. Um, I'll wait to see what people vote on. Then for June, go ahead and finish getting your hero value as high as possible because I can. And I believe the higher hero value actually makes them uh, even better. Let's see, some of these actually give other stats. So, fight. All right, gives us a little bit in everything, so we'll go ahead and put points in that. Um, survival gives us HP. Hear noise for agility. Tactics. Trick. March. We also need formation. Um... How many fucking fire lance? All right, we got four fire lances and firestorms. So we're going to teach both to Yume. Good stuff. Get rid of charge, slanting rain. Um, is there any useful transmutes right now? I don't think there's going to be, but... Might as well check. No. No. Oh yeah, we can make another Bracelet of Zoe. Uh, Bracelet of Zoe is basically uh, increases the XP a character gets. Um, but the thing is, the Holy Grail, every chapter is going to give us something that will increase the stats of a character, and that is much better than a simple... Um, Freaking uh, uh, equipment. Oh, it raises. Ma that's right. It raises max HP when they level up. That's right. I'm thinking of something else. Still, you know, basically getting 200 HP per level up adds up. You know. Get 30 levels while wearing it, get an extra, uh, 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 uh 6,000 health. Equip two bracelets of Zoe, make it 12,000 health. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Um, how is our equipment looking as well? We want to divine a few miscellaneous things. Um, we don't have anything super special, so it's just going to be another... Uh, two Rabbit's Foot, Ambers of Happiness, Teachings of Bethanus. Um, we're going to do Equipment. We need to go over to Belenus. 
Gonna give him the... As he's going up. And go ahead and transfer him. He can GTFO. I think how Arngrim's like negative 89. Like, dude is not going to Valhalla. <laughs> it's kind of a shit. Kind of a shit. He may be a bastard with a heart of gold, but damn is he a bastard. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go ahead and save. Get the save here. Alright, I think that's long enough. Lawfer? Alright. Loud and clear, people. Loud and clear. Let's give Lawfer the other two Mababa Thinga Jiggers. Thinga Thinga Jigamabobs. These things are kind of weird. They don't say that they give something. But they do, uh, they do conf confer some kind of effect. I don't remember exactly what it, each of them does. Um, the only one I know off the top of my head is an item that will show up later. Because there is one thing where it gets to the point where they start giving us requirements where we can't meet all of the requirements. And one of them is like, hey, we want a character who can swim. And there's one of these uh, miscellaneous items basically gives the ability to swim effectively. Um, it is also like one of the things where like character matters because our our mermaid uh, obviously already has the ability to swim. So, you know, she she will count for that check mark when sending up. Um, we do want to take off the sick ass spinning spear. Uh, he can take one of the 50 billion short spears we have. Um, we're also going to switch him back to... Actually, you know what? We're going to get some better gear next chapter anyway. We'll leave him with the silver equipment. Let's go ahead and transfer up Lawfer. Um, what is our evaluation? We're at 63. All right. I think we're okay. Seems a bit low. I'm trying to keep an eyeball on it. I gotta keep my evaluation. Like, I need it down, but I need it high enough to uh, trigger a few things and not drop too low. Otherwise, we will get the bad ending and not the best one. All right. Let's go ahead and end this chapter. see how things are going up in the war. It has been a long time, Lenneth. Hey, Freya. What's going on? Is as How's shit going on at war? All right, that's, that's not a big change. I don't know what Our other forces are supposed to mean. The enemy is fighting ferociously. We must take care. All right. Do you wish to know the status of our unhaired? All right, let's see Do how our people are doing. Status? We're not going to go through and see all like each of these colored things has like a uh, a little mini generic event kind of thing. Let's see. All right. All right. Uh, looks like she fucked up an investigation, but uh, looks like she's rising through the ranks of godhood. Do you wish to know the status of our unhaired? Let's see how uh, Lelwyn's doing. You wish to know his status? He did a bang out job last chapter. Uh, looks like he fucked up a special mission, but uh, he made up for it with some other exploits. So yeah, he's doing okay. Do you wish to know the status of our unharried? Let's see how Bolenis and then Lawfer are doing. You know, they're they're fresh faces to the war effort. Damn, he has got a sheet. He fucked up some spies. He planned to strike. All right. All right. Acquired 69 hero value. Nice. Very nice, Belenis. 
I approve. Do you wish to know the status of our <laughs> The 69s, they're everywhere. Do you wish to know his status? Let's see how Lawfer did. All right. All right. I did okay. I planned a fair share. Oh, I think I forgot to spend the rest of the trait points. So I think if uh, leadership and identify, like if I think if those were higher, they would have a higher positive result. Um, it looks like he either fucked up finding a wounded soldier or like the wounded soldier was bait. Uh, so it's kind of funny that Belenis is doing better than our uh, noble pretty boy. Do you wish to know the status of our Anheryar? Uh, pretty boy, Justice Knight, doing worse than sad noble man. Lenin, about your performance, it is magnificent. Hell yeah. These are all the materialized points I can grant you at this time. All right. And see, this is why I want to send two characters up at the same time. Is we want more material. We want more points. We use this to get items and Odin transmute things. With you. He bids me give you these artifacts. It also affects what artifacts Odin gives us. Um, it's nice that we got Lightning Bolt and that we have another heal to use. Um, but other than those two, eh, it's, it's fine. We got okay things. Lenith, I have a request to make of you. We need archers. Okay. Send us someone who can strike from a distance. Okay. We need an Einherjar who can gather intelligence. Send us an Einherjar skilled at reconnaissance. May fate guide your hand. I pray for your good fortune. I see. So maybe we're going to regret sending Lelwyn up, because I think we're only going to get one archer this chapter. Um, let's go ahead and save post. So yeah, I need a rogue. Yeah. Actually, yeah, I really, there is a specific archer that I hope we get. If we get two archers, I'll send both of them just to meet the max requirements. But I don't think I'm going to get uh, both. I think I'm only going to get one of them. 